August 12, 2022. Daily Bread. Passage Ephesians chapter 2, verse 11 through verse 22. Key verse 15 and 16. Title, Reconciled through Christ. Therefore, remember that formerly you who are Gentiles by birth and called uncircumcised by those who call themselves the circumcision, which is done in the body by human hands, remember that at that time you were separate from Christ, excluded from citizenship in Israel, and foreigners to the covenants of the promise, without hope and without God in the world. But now in Christ Jesus, you who were once far away have been brought near by the blood of Christ, for he himself is our peace, who has made the two groups one and has destroyed the barrier, the dividing wall of hostility. By setting aside in his flesh the law with its commands and regulations, his purpose was to create in himself one new humanity out of the two, thus making peace and in one body to reconcile both of them to God through the cross, by which he put to death their hostility. He came and preached peace to you who were far away, and peace to those who were near. For through him we both have access to the Father by one Spirit. Consequently, you are no longer foreigners and strangers, but fellow citizens with God's people, and also members of his household. Built on the foundation of the apostles and prophets, with Christ Jesus himself as the chief cornerstone, In him, the whole building is joined together and rises to become a holy temple in the Lord. And in him, you too are being built together to become a dwelling in which God lives by his Spirit. Daily Bread Message Paul was writing to the Gentile Christians in Ephesus. As Gentiles, they were not circumcised, were not Jews, and were not his chosen people, nor did they receive the covenants nor the promises. Though they were far from God, they have been brought near to God through the blood of Christ. We too went far from God, but have been brought near to God by the blood of Christ. Christ is our peace. Through his perfect sacrifice on the cross, Jesus did away with the old system of laws and sacrifices. Now anyone can draw near to God through his blood. Ultimately, God's plan was to unite the Jews and Gentiles through Christ's sacrifice. They are now reconciled and united in him and enjoy real peace with each other through the Holy Spirit. Thus, All Christians belong to the household of God, are citizens of his kingdom, and are built into the living temple of God with Christ as the chief cornerstone, and the prophets and apostles as the foundations. This is the vessel of the Holy Spirit. Is there any believer that you need to reconcile with? Prayer Father, thank you for Jesus, who died on the cross to reconcile us to you, and to others to make one body in Christ. Help me to enjoy your peace with others through Christ's blood. One word, reconciled through Christ's blood.